everybody, welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. We're here at Misty's shop with my buddy here. And I gotta go meet Dex. Apparently he's gonna chill out here and let me go on my own. Thanks, man. Thanks for backing me up here. I thought you were my best friend, but... Oh, Regina. V, listen. What? What? I've got this delicate matter. Okay. That's why I called you. Fine. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Right. Now, that's probably not news to you, okay. but this issue matters to me All for right. a few reasons. Tell me. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. There are various ways to contest incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hacks, non-lethal weapons, EMP grenades, and some combat gadgets. Weapon mods can that change damage to non-lethal. If a given weapon, combat gadget, or quick hand deals non-lethal damage, it will be mentioned in the description. Okay. I need to go talk to Dex first. What's going on here? Uh, I'm not going to watch him, but I'll watch her. But I can't. I got a job. I got to do. I can go in there. Let's see. Oh, reboot optics, short circuit, breach protocol. Neat. Ram usage reduced by one. Cool. How about you? What are you? Uh, NC resident. Okay. This is kind of cool. All right. So let me get going. That guy. Netrunner. Oh, he's not a good person to deal with. Got it. Meet Dext. Alright, I guess I'll get my car. Go. Look at my car. What the heck? I have a ghost car. Oh, radio. Yeah. Alright. Wait till this guy goes by, or this girl, woman, goes by. Oh, that doesn't look good. I don't know what's going on. Oh, there's something going on over there. You don't want to park right there. Hey. Right here's good. Whoa, wow, look at that. certain actions will reward you with street cred. Build your street cred and make a name for yourself in Night City Underworld. Alright, cool. To, con to control the direction of a bullet. Really? Bullet ricochets if you... Wait. Power weapons allow you to control the direction of bullet ricochets if you have ballistic... Which I do. And trajectory... That's weird. Okay. I'm taking whatever I can over here. Yeah, man. This is 
great. And I walked into it, so I'm like, this is a jackpot. It's fantastic. What else is here I can take? Back here, no? Got anything here? Uh, hey, don't mind me, officer. Suck. Could arrest you at any moment. Okay, I'm sorry. Guitar pick, cool. Anything else? Oh, let me go. Man, you're still sitting there after all that? Dang. All right, cool. Man, that worked out great for me. <laughs> I've just made. I just got a bunch of equipment and friggin' money. All right, this is good. So uh, let's go check out uh, what this guy wants. You're pretty intimidating looking. Right. Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> let's roll. All right. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? <laughs> Would What's you rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? I don't know about that. I'll remember you. That's all counts. No, but Mr. Nobody don't survive the city. You're either somebody, or you fizzle out into nothing. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, I choose to be Mr. Chill, but folk who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Why meet me? Why the Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and Sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. Huh. So here we are. All right. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you, but we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. I like eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Hmm. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. All right. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith's doubt of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy, what's he like? 
A straight psychopath. Chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. Okay. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent. Internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip-tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Client, Client. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Yes? Quiet life? Or blaze of glory. Hmm? Later now. Hi, Mr. Dexter. You have a nice car. Dexter, talk to Dex. <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nug. He, wa he was out to look over. Watch this. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Chingon. And there's the other thing. Oh, wait, I see. Nick, you don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junky snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. And there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Barely. Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. I must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Uh, we'll do Maelstrom. I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What a lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods and put my nose to the ground. Hasta luego, muchacho. Okay. Bounce back. I got, to... I got some stuff on me. I kind of want to call Militech agent down. Right. Military cage, you know. Stout, bear to stout. Call. Stout here. Start by telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced the convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you know. <laughs> Don't make me wait. Nuh uh, not on the horn. Let's meet, cut a deal. A deal. Fine. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there. 
All right. Not going to meet with Jackie. Uh, yeah, let's look at my stuff real quick. My inventory, because I picked up a bunch of freaking stuff. See, look at that. Oh my god, I picked up a lot of stuff. So that's my gun there. Mine's better. Mine's better. Mine's better. That's close. Wouldn't mind getting another gun, though. Attachments. What's that? A designer has a site built to function as a well... As well as a... As beauty. It's built in glass reflector and boosts ability at all times. Alright, cool. Alright. Weapon. I wouldn't mind putting another one. Submachine gun, submachine gun, so... Put the assault rifle probably there. That wouldn't be bad. Either that one, 62. We're gonna go with this one. There we go. All right, so that's done with. And I'll put the submachine gun there. Which one's there? That one. Okay, we're set. All right, now then. Oh, uh, let's look at clothes. Clothes-wise, we picked up some, <laughs> look at that thing. It looks terrible. Poly made blend suit. I must sell some of this stuff, that is for sure. Uh, can I disassemble? That's 47. It's 49. 60. I'm not Oh, yeah. 47, I'm probably gonna. Yeah, let's, let's disassemble that. Alright. There we go. Uh, we got some shoes, apparently, we picked up. And I'm definitely not gonna put those things on, even though they're better shoes. I just don't like the way they look. They're cream, so. And six, no, disassemble that. All right, uh, looks like we're good. Okay. Hold on a minute. What's with the one? I have an attribute available? When did that happen? Where's my intelligence? All right, well, we'll... It's cool. Increase critical damage, purge, bloodbath, uh... Breach protocol, uh, crafting engineering. Hey, you know what, let's do that. There we go. And I can do another, so what's that? Do I have one up here already? No, I don't. I know I have one of something. Oh, there it is, handguns. Reduces reload time. Increases critical chance with pistols, 4%. Increases headside jam on supply with pistols and revolver, 10%. I do like that. Okay. All right, we're good. There. There you go. Put it away. Oh wait, let me see what it looks like. Oh, that's cool. Oh, oh shoot, I didn't know that. <laughs> okay, good thing I didn't do that. So uh, let's call my car. Where's my car? I called it. There it is. Awesome. All right. Let's meet with Jackie. Okay. And away we go. Go hauling butt down the road. I'm not paying attention to the green lights, which I really should. What's that? 
That question mark over there. I want to see that. What? V, what? A rat problem on my block. Who doesn't, right? Thing is, these rats are human-sized. Look just like tiger claws too. Biggest one is a certain Taki Kinmochi. So do your fixer a solid and neutralize her ass, will you? Go around me. Deeds attached. I will, but I thought I saw. What's that? It's locked. I wonder what that is. Can I open that? No. Oh, can't get in there. All right, fine. Oh, sorry. Apparently. All right, off we go. All right, Jackie, where are you, man? There, I like this view better. I don't like the up close view. There it goes. Now I can see. Yeah, I like this view a lot better. Oh shoot, I missed him. I wasn't paying attention. Where are they? Yeah. Uh, I got it. Here we go. Uh, I know a guy who knows a guy. All right, Jack, keep coming. Ah, there you are. It's fast travel. All right, so I'll meet with Jackie. All right, Jackie, I'm here. Hiya, Porfin. Let me hear what you squared away. Then an arch? Oh, damn. What a beaut. Yeah, got her cheap, too. Dorset job dividend. Hmm. Don't know how you could scrape together enough for that beast. Even used. Well, I... I took out a loan, but muy pequeñito. But I mean, it's totally worth it. Okay. Right. I'd swap out that tailpipe if I were you. Really? Why? It's got a mean growl that the chicas just love. <laughs> what that growl does is tell people a mile out that Jackie's rumbling their way. I'd tinker with the fuel injection, too. Upload a new map and slap on some thermal tape till you cobble together enough eddies to get that exhaust modded. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Uh. T book show any sign of life? You two talk. She's up to date. Fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. All right. They're familiar, you know. Worked together before Dex took his break. All right. Been waiting long. My mother always said patience pays off, so... So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You skin yet? You got a plan? Well, I can't buy him off because I don't have the money for it. That shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right, the strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. No, so, that is some serious beast den. logic right there, buddy. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. All right. I hate these pork fuckers. Had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I'll take the Valentinos. 
They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Well, this is the hiccup. Go on, let them know we're here. You know what? It says I need to meet the Militech agent. I will in a minute. Be right back. I'm gonna use your bike. Hold on. Can't use your bike. Damn. Where's the map? Well, the map's not too far where I can meet the agent, so I'm gonna do that. Where is that? Uh. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. I, I got. We gotta meet this. I gotta meet this Militech agent first. Right back, Jackie. Hold on. Don't do anything stupid. Okay. Oh, that was close. out all right I don't know how to get down there there you go all right there we go all right Let's see what they have to say look lively Meredith stout Take it you were the one to call? Hey, you're kind of cute. That'd be me. Ow! Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down! I just want to talk! Meredith? Shut your trap! A fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? Yep. Just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep now. You're a jerk, man. I take back. You look good. Now listen. You're oh! Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <sighs> Oh, you didn't do much there, did you? You're ugly. Him, you can let go. Thank you. I want to hear what he has to say. Thanks. He's relaxed already. You want info? I want. No yeah, man, your convoy security mess. I can help. I don't know what that means, but you know, I could help patch the gaps in your convoy security, prevent a repeat of this fiasco. Nope, not interested. Let's hear your offer. I don't have all day. All right. Couldn't have been chill from the start. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Tell me what you want. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force. But they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine. The latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. 
I can do that. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. Some shards you find in the world will contain information hidden behind data encryption measures. To decrypt the shard, first either open it through the notification when you acquire it, or find it later in the shards tab under journal in the main menu. Then select crack security to unlock the secrets. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. That doesn't sound very nice of you. You're making a mistake. This guy's already good at dead. But she'll take you down with Bye. It. This has been fun. Is that my car? How did it get here? Man, my car is amazing. It's like like Night Rider or something like that. So under the journals tab, right? So let's go look at this. Eh, 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 eh. Journals tab chart. There it is. How do I crack security? 55. IPD. All right. Fifty-five, then? Okay. Can I do it again? Let's see. I don't know if I can or not. Journal? Chart? Let's see. Let's see. So... Do fifty-five. One C. Oh, there. One C. Where's E9? Installed. Okay. I'll take other things. All right. So let's right, I'm give it a shot. I'm trying to learn how to do this. Ah! Military chart. We're going to figure this out. That's it? That's all I can do. All right. Whatever. All right. Let's get in the car. Let's go find Jackie. Use the intercom. How to get out of here? Maybe somebody can help me get out of here. <laughs> Maybe here? Yeah, right here. Okay. Oh no! Ah! Uh, I'm not a very good driver. All right, let's try again. So before we go inside this Shush man. Wait, let's take a look real quick over here. Did I grab something? Nope, I don't want to turn it on. Could be something here maybe I can grab. Awesome. Well, that's kinda cool I can look around. I don't look like there's anything here though. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> I know, but we're not gonna do it right yet. I'm trying to look around real quick. 
see if there's anything or maybe I could just, what's this? Oh, nothing, dang it, I thought maybe that might have been something. All right, well, I guess there's nothing here. That's too bad. That would have been cool to grab something. Got a radio also? That's a radio. I don't care about the radio. All right. So, uh, yeah, we'll leave it off here. So we got beat up by a really hot woman, which is, uh, I don't know how to take that. It's a good thing or a bad thing, <laughs> but either way, all right. And uh, we got to meet Tech Dexter, who seems like a pretty chill cap, which I have highly doubt that he is. And in my next episode, we're going to go in here, use the intercom, and talk to these guys here in the mail room. So, oh boy, this should be fun. So, thanks a lot, guys, for watching. I do appreciate it. I hope you liked it. So, I'll leave it like you did. For? Oh, wait, shut up and try to talk. And uh, leave a like. Do all those little things to help me out. I really do appreciate it. I hope to see you again here on another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. Bye bye.